Welcome back to another episode of TMC. We are here on your Wednesday night. A little late, but better than never. Are we though? You'll see if you follow us on Twitter, you'll know why. <laughs> I am not going to check that. <laughs> I tried to tag you, but I couldn't find you. It's like you deleted your Twitter. I blocked you on Twitter, dude. <laughs> I also, I what is Twitter, dude? What oh, is sorry, this X, Twitter? Dude, X, dude. Sorry, <laughs> I was Twitter? in a different universe. I had to switch back to this universe. <laughs> All right, we are back. We got Ryan, Brandon, Steven, and Tony back this week. Playing Tony. some magic. Who wants to kick us off with deck introductions? Um, I'll start first. Yeah, oh, there we go. Tony got gone. I'm playing uh, Zer Eternal Schemer. Uh, I'm just going to be uh, playing a bunch of enchantments and then turning them into some... Uh, Creatures with Death Touch, Life Link, and Hex Proof. That's scary. For three mana, too. For three mana. For three mana. He's less scary than the normal Zer. That's all I'm going to throw out there. That is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> it is than the normal Zer. All right. I'm always next? worried about whatever Commander Tony's playing, dude, because it's always something, you know? So we got an Esper. Uh, what's uh, Steven playing? Yeah, dude, so I'm actually excited about what I'm playing tonight for the first time ever. And, uh, oh, God, my camera's all jacked up. Hold on. <laughs> so tonight I'm playing Kess, Dissident Mage. Um, I made this custom proxy, if I can get it to go into focus. One second. Yeah, you ain't focusing. Yeah, Steven's like, you know, I could play new commanders, or I could just make new cards that are the same commander and play them again. Exactly, dude. Now so yeah, that's, that's an idea. idea. Well, there's so only so many cast. angels, so. <laughs> but but it's not a cast build that I've ever done before. It's a really jank build, and I didn't tell anyone like what it's actually doing. Um, so I'm gonna let it be a surprise to you guys. And I mean, hopefully, it actually does what I built it to do. We'll we'll just say that first of all. Sometimes that doesn't happen, but. Uh, <laughs> But yeah, dude, I'm excited. I found this uh, image on the internet, and uh, shout out to, hold on, let me see, random internet person, Arcane Alterations for that Kess Alter inspiration there. And also shout out to Adobe Photoshop. <laughs> All right. Ryan, what are you playing? Tonight, I'm going to be playing Starstream, Power Hungry slash Seeker Leader. Um... Playing, you know, an animated cartoon character. What can I say? Uh, he cares about being Monarch. So that's what I'm going to be doing. Doing some Monarching. I'm going to be, you know, trying to evaluate who's more fit to be a leader than me. And then always telling you you're wrong. Um, <laughs> kind of like some of my party members in Baldur's Gate. <laughs> I, feel like, I feel like Ryan might be projecting his real life personality into his commander deck right now. We'll have to see. It's in the cards. I'm just, I'm just glad I don't work with Ryan, dude. That must be a nightmare. Anyways, <laughs> what about Brandon? Yeah, what you doing, Brandon? He's uh... he's currently playing Baldur's Gate. All right, <laughs> all right. <laughs> we can't hear you, Brandon. We can't hear you, bro. Sorry, I had to get my 22 months in the chat there. 22 <laughs> months subbed, feeling 22. Uh, I'm playing BioCourt Space Godzilla. Um, is this <laughs> magic that we're playing right now? <laughs> yeah, dude, what game are you playing? Transformers and Godzilla. That's what we're playing right now. Yeah, dude, I've heard way more about Godzilla and Transformers than I ever have about some woman named Kess. So, well, I don't know what to tell you. That's because you've been hearing the wrong things. That's why. Uh, I got a Godzilla with cannons on his shoulders that are also volcanoes. He looks like a crackhead that got a hold of the wrong stuff. True. Uh, he's a 6-6 six, six with mutate and trample, and you can cast him uh, from your graveyard using his mutate ability. Oh. I'll be basic. like Steven and say, I'm also not going to tell you what my deck does. Well, it, it's probably a graveyard deck, <laughs> just based off of that. Something so like I'm that. It's the graveyard deck colors, and it has graveyard in the Resub hype, exactly <laughs> friendly. We got the resub hype. 
Actually, also friendly. Let's see if this worked tonight. Uh, if you've built up some channel points now. Uh... Oh yeah, is, is our stuff working this week finally? It was real quiet. I heard it, it for a work. second. Never mind. Sorry. Don't worry about it. It's still broken. <laughs> oh, is it text to chat not working? Uh, uh, apparently not. I apparently heard it's super quiet. I heard it. Yeah, but I it's super dude. quiet. Yeah. Can't I don't know why. Anymore. Don't know why. It's probably set to the same volume as the music. Uh, well, let's figure that out. Why is the music not playing? The music is playing. Too late. It's I can't hear any magic. Music. We're here to play. We'll figure it out eventually music. sometime this year. All right, Ryan, while we're going to figure out all these issues we got, we have no music, we have no text to speech, and, <laughs> and I'm not vibing right now. Not vibing at all. Not vibing, dude. I feel like he's now vibing a little bit. Here. Now I'm starting right, to hear. Cue the cutscene. Let's let's get set up. <laughs> all right, we we are set up. <laughs> Boom. Didn't hear anything. Yeah, I heard some guy mumbling Did in the music. <laughs> anyway, who's who's gonna roll? See who goes first. Who wants to go first? Exactly, friendly. Just yell real loud. Just caps lock when you're yelling. Did you actually play the cutscene or no? No, I haven't. Weeks. But I told you to. That's a shame. Why wouldn't you? Did you intentionally not do it because I told you to? No, I, just I rolled hadn't a been two doing it lately. <laughs> I don't believe you, dude. I don't believe you one bit. I got eleven. Brandon told me that nobody liked it, so I stopped doing it. Nobody liked it, bro. Then they, then why are people subscribing, dude, if they don't like it, you know? Well, they Ask. haven't been. <laughs> That's why we're changing it. 200 subscribers on YouTube, dude. That counts for something, all right? All right, all right, all right. Anyway, I'm going to roll a uh, 20-sided die oh, here. Roll a five. I, got I rolled a two, dude. It doesn't get worse than what I got. Oh, I'm yeah. Eleven. Fifteen for me. Good. I'm gonna move this all the way. All right. Uh, I think I'm third. Brandon's last. Yep. Actually, I got to show my deck now too. All right, brothers. Uh, <laughs> let's cut the deck. Draw some cards. Play some magics. Oh. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. Snap it in the corner. Lower mm -hmm. face. That's a better position for me right there, dude. Right here. All right. Uh, is this key hand keepable? Uh, yeah. I think it is. I'm ready. Boom. You know what? I'm gonna molly. I'm gonna molly, dude. I'm gonna keep. Are you? Yeah, yeah, it wasn't a great hand. What is my back? Oh, <laughs> it's uh, that's Barack Obama and that's Cloud Strife. Oh, and I gotta fix it too. You can see my green screen. How unprofessional of me. Unprofessional, dude. This is probably one of my favorite pictures on the internet. I'll keep. I'm ready. You see, he's got it. Obama's got his hand around him too. It's a All great right, pitch. chat. Get the predictions in. We got the predictions up. Lotto, what's up, baby? Predict. Uh, Lotto, I'm not an idiot, doing, dude. Yes, I still want to participate. Participate with custom amount. I've got 52,000 points. I'm putting 10,000, 10 points on Tony. Whoa. Yeah, I'm, I'm making bank tonight, dude. That's like putting a, a anytime <laughs> touchdown score on Christian McCaffrey. It's just free money. Free money. <laughs> All right, y'all ready? Oh, yeah, dude. You see that lotto? Where else can you go? And you got a lotto chat. Ooh, waiting for you, dude. <laughs> Only here at TMC. Oh, shit. And lotto, <laughs> lotto speak is some kind of tongue in chat. Oh. Oh god. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh no. All right. What 
What's going on, man? What's going All right. On? I was oh, waiting for y'all to tell me y'all ready. I asked like three times. Oh, yeah. I've been ready. I've been born ready. You was born ready? All right. Well, I'm going to get started then. Yep, yep. All right. I'm going to draw. I'm going to play a swamp. And then I'm going to pay one. It's a snow covered swamp from a secret layer. Uh, I'm going to play a blood fountain. Uh, and there's a battlefield. I get to make a blood token. So I'll make a blood nope. token. And then it has activated ability uh, to pay for, tap it, sacrifice it, and return up to two target creature cards from your graveyard to your hand. And I'll be passing turn. Oh. Also known as I made two artifacts for one mana. <laughs> <laughs> I want to play the Cloud. Untapped since I have two or more opponents and pass. Uh, right. Lotto, yes, we did start late. Uh, Steven said that he would be here at 8 30 and then was here at 8 About that, about that. You know, <laughs> circumstances, I'm going to play a Badlands, tap it, cast out a Soul Ring. Yeah, some people were like. That's it. You got a pump at least, can't, though? You can't lead no pump. more, but lead anyway. I did get a pump, dude. I got a pump in, bro. I got went to the gym, worked out. It was nice. Um, yeah. I'm going to draw a card. Uh, oh, this. Look at this right here. Card that's not in your deck? Yeah. This is bad. <laughs> uh, Lurk, got to get some Looks work cool, done. Though. All right, thanks, Lotto. You're the man, dude. Uh, I'm going to play the Shizo Death Storehouse and uh, pass my turn. I, my turn. Y'all know about the Shizo? Untap, draw. Target legendary creature gains fear until end of turn, and it also man, taps for a back, uh, black. That's an old card, man. Yeah, pretty good, though. Pretty good. I'll play another Swamp. Um, better than a Swamp, dude. It's a Swamp, but better. I will play a Mana Crypt. Ooh, that's pretty uh -oh. good. The Shizo. That's right, friendly. I'll pay two and one. The Shizo. I'm going to cast uh, the more than meets the eye side of my commander. I can pay three instead of four for it. Uh, and it's the back side of my commander here. Where, he, where he's an airplane. <laughs> I didn't hear any sound. Yeah, I don't have one. It wouldn't save. Oh, it didn't work. Damn. Yeah. All right. Uh, it has, it's week, a 2-3 vehicle, but it has living metal. Damn. As long as it's my turn, it's also a uh, creature. It has Flying Menace Haste, and it's a 2-3. Whenever it deals combat damage to a player, if there is not a Monarch, that player becomes the Monarch. And whenever I become the Monarch, I get to flip Starscream over to his other side. So I'll go to combat, and uh, I'll give Brandon a little love tap. Oh, dude, you're going to regret that. No, you're going to like that, castle. bro. King of the castle. King of the castle. You can take two damage. King of the castle. King of the castle. Look at my chair. And you become the monarch. Look at my chair. Look at the castle. Look at the castle. My wife. All right. Very nice. All right. So Brandon is the monarch now. And, I do. I got this little crown uh, up here. You see my little crown up there? We'll pass turn there. Let's see what Tony's got for turn two here. Uh, swamp and pass. Nice, dude. What'd you call us? No, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> swamp ass. Swamp What's up? Draw. Ah, uh, let's see here. We're going to do a training center. It comes in untapped. We've got four mana. What am I going to do with that? Do this. I might do that. I'll tap Badlands for black, and I'm going to cast Mr. Cool's favorite card, Dark Ritual. A dark Ritual. Which generates effect. three black mana into my mana pool. Ooh, woo! And then I'm going to use that one, two, three, four, five, and six. And I'm going to cast out a legendary artifact known as Bolas's Citadel. On turn two, baby, because that's how we do it. Combo. I thought you said yeah. you built this deck different than any other deck. 
I've never built Kes this way. Here comes <laughs> oh, the it's all, it has all the same cards in it. Blue, <laughs> they, they he just put the same right? cards in, but he put them in in a different order. That's yeah. what he meant by he built it. Just give me it more time, bro. Just give me more time. All right, I'll pass her. <laughs> Look, this Bolus's Citadel is just a contingency plan in case my deck doesn't do the thing I built it to do, okay? That's really what's I don't going believe on. You. I'm going to play this Besedju. Plus, it looks super cool, dude. How could you not? How would you not play that card? You know. And then I'm going to pay two mana and demonic tutor. Mr. Cool second back. favorite card. Hey, hey we're, this is the Mr. Cool episode. Brandon, what's up, dude? You tomorrow, yeah. bro. You draw an insta. Oh. Up. oh, okay. Yeah, you're right. All right. Well, then, hold on. Let me go find a card I want. I'll go ahead and uh, start resolving my upkeep triggers and stuff. So untap. Uh, start stream as a creature again because it's my turn. What's underneath Bolus Citadel? Uh, Soul Ring. Okay. He's like, Tudor Chosen Grip. All right. <laughs> Do it, bro. I'll make you more. Uh, all right. Close and shuffle. And then in my end step, I draw a card. Yep. Nice. All right, my upkeep, I untapped upkeep. I got a, a roll for Mana Crypt. So I will flip a coin. Uh, we'll do uh, heads is I don't take damage. I got heads. No damage. All right. Um, Brandon, I hate to do this to you, buddy. Uh, Bro, it looks like Brandon is Texas and Ryan is the federal government. <laughs> uh, but... Uh, I got a, I got my crown. I need that crown now. But we're friends after Dude, this. <laughs> this sounds like some bullshit. You might be a friend, but I am no friend. Anyway, I'm swinging it's my like commander at two. you. Uh, and then I get the crown. You flip him, right? Boom. I get the monarch, and he flips over whenever I become the monarch. Ryan got head. Good for him. <laughs> Boom. Who said that? Who? All right. <laughs> Who said that? Friendly. <laughs> Let me see. I got to pull it up, dude. <laughs> so my commander flipped over. Uh, the front side of my commander says that whenever I draw a card, if I'm the monarch, target opponent loses two life. And then if any creatures deal damage to me, uh, I get to flip Starscream back over to his other side. Oh, that's awesome. Uh, second main, I'm going to play a swamp. I'm going to pay five and play uh, all Homerets Archive. Good God. They're friendly. You are figuring everything out here today, too. Ryan, I mean, Steven is a filthy liar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. I've always wondered if anything I say on this stream could be used against me in a court of law. <laughs> uh, we're all playing a character. <laughs> Just in case. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's true. That's true. All right. Uh, I played all Hamrat's archive. I'll go to my end step. I'm the monarch. Uh, so I get to draw. And when I draw, I get to draw an additional card. So I'll draw two for being the monarch. And, and that's right, the Steven. target player loses or through Anthony. life twice. Yeah. Yeah, I get to do two damage uh, to somebody. I'll do two to Tony and two to Steven. Yeah, there all you right. go. At the end of your turn, I'm going to enlighten tutor. He's two boys. I already uh, know what I'm getting. So, yeah. so whenever, if we, any of our creatures deal combat damage to Steven or to Ryan, he's forced to swap back to the other side of Starscream. Correct. Which isn't a creature. Lame, bro. <laughs> it seems like we need some creatures up in here, y'all. Until it's your turn, then it is a creature. Man, maybe you should run some in your deck then. <laughs> I'm getting propaganda. You over there acting like you know what my deck does or something, man. You don't Dude, know. What you my ain't deck had more does. than. I don't even know what my deck. You does. ain't had more than twelve creatures in a deck in years. <laughs> I've actually got thirteen creatures in this deck right now. I'll have you know that as a fact. One that of those is Dockside. <laughs> if you count the commander, there's thirteen. Oh, if you count the commander, okay. I think. Yeah, I'm gonna play propaganda. Propaganda. Oh. Hey, uh, wow, wow he, that's he, basically he, like a creature, dude. His propaganda says no robots allowed. <laughs> uh, 
I, you know, I thought here I was thinking that Ryan was the federal government. Well, it turns out I was wrong. Turns out it's everyone around you. Exactly, bro. It's, it's just gross. I'm going to drop out of Volcanic Island, and There's I'm going to your skin. pay one life and uh, cast the top card of my library, which is a brainstorm. And uh, so I'll let that resolve. I'll draw three cards and then put two cards from my hand on top of my library in any order. And D in, I'll pay two life, and I'll play the top card in my library, which is a search for as Kanta. Drop Wait, that out there. Grass again. Yeah, brother. That's how That's we all do you it. done all day. Mm -hmm. Does anyone have any creatures? I do. Ryan does. Ryan has a creature. Let me see what his creature does, dude. Does it? It's a two-three flyer. Whenever you draw a card through the monarch target, only loses like two life. Every one or more creatures deals combat damage, so you convert him. Right? He's also the monarch right now, so at the end of his turn, he's drawing two cards no matter what. Unless you hit him, and then it you become the monarch, and you force him to swap to the other side. All right, I'm going to pay a red, and I'm going to Faithless Looting. Um, That's not hitting just... him. <laughs> Wrong try. <laughs> you got to find that 13 creature in there. Are there any creatures in graveyards? Nope. No. Negative. It's turn like three. <laughs> I'm going to pay three in flashback faithless looting. Wow. He's trying to find a creature so he can reanimate it. <laughs> Still no creatures. <laughs> Negative ghost. Having creatures in a deck built around the monarch mechanic, nah, uncalled for. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. All right, boys, that's all I can do, pass her. Alrighty then. Uh. Untap, upkeep, draw the card. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go one and a green. Get a ramp. Uh, cobra. Lotus Cobra. Okay. Uh, and then I'll play this Path of Ancestry tapped as well. Good and I'll mana. make a yeah green mana. It doesn't matter. I can't play anything with it. Oh, shame. Uh, yeah, I know. I wish. Pass turn. All right, uh, I will untap, uh, upkeep, mana crypt trigger, I will flip a coin, oh, uh, it's that. heads, no damage again, best mana crypt ever, bro, all right, uh, and then I Ask if any creatures in draw for on turn. turn three, because he's playing turbo spree, being got a <laughs> six drop on turn two. Uh... <laughs> You don't know. Yeah, I drew <laughs> just one card because it's my draw step. I don't draw two on that one. So I have two damage. Tony, you're at the highest, brother. Oh. You lose two. <clears throat> um, you're making some enemies around here, I think, Ryan. I'm, 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 sure I'm aware. <laughs> um, so I will play a swamp and see what I want to do. I'll uh, tap my mana crypt and play a dowsing dagger. Uh, when dowsing, Such a Ryan staple. When dowsing, I thought you'd say that. All right. Uh, Ryan is a very violent king. Exactly. Do I even need to be here for this game if you just know <laughs> what I'm gonna say and do at all times? Just, just use AI and generate what would be my turn. All right. You play top and aether flux, and then you go off and you combo and you win. <laughs> Oh, there. Most <laughs> AI can find on the internet. Not on That's purpose, but I put them in the happens. deck. <laughs> it's not like I meant to play Bolas's Citadel, dude. I just happened to draw into it. Okay. Could just not be in the deck, like I said. Uh, <laughs> How am I gonna win if this? Is not... 
I don't have bolus in my deck. I don't have win cons. All right. Anyway, uh, uh, Tony, I'm gonna give you two O2 plants with this thousand. Oh, I dagger. absolutely believe in AI. Oh, can play better than me. Get you some blockers out there. You know, you got these cobras sitting around here. You gotta watch out. Hi, right, give me a sec. Give me five <laughs> plants. All right, I'm gonna pay two. I'm gonna go ahead and equip this here dagger to my star screen. That makes him a rogue. Uh, it makes him a four four. <laughs> um, and then I'm gonna go to combat, I guess. I'll swing. What's up, Violet? Uh, so is Ant winning this one? I hope so. I put 10,000 channel points on him. <laughs> Tony, yeah. Tony, I'm going to go ahead and swing at you since I already hit Brandon for a bunch of commanders. Brian's I'm going like, to pay the two. Brian's trying to take my channel points. So we'll pay the two? Yeah, I'll pay the two. Yeah. Oh, right. Tony's going to win, huh? It's uh, four in there. Yeah. yeah. Did you hear me? It was four? Oh, it was four? Yeah, it's a four four with the dagger on him. Okay. Did you pay the two to attack him? I did. He did. I ain't got no plants, but I got some dinosaur eggs. Okay, those will work. Hey, those will work. Uh, Close enough, dude. Hey, what's the difference? Whenever, hey, whenever Star Screen Damn, deals, dude, on <laughs> whenever the creature equipped with Dazzling Dagger deals damage, uh, it transforms. Unfortunate. So it flips and becomes a land called the Lost Veil. Vale. It taps for three mana of any one color. I really wish he hadn't done that. I'm going to go ahead and tap it for three. Uh, black, I'll pay you one for a Wayfarer's Bubble, and I'll go ahead and crack it. Careful what you wish for, Steven. Well, I wasn't wishing for an eggplant. What do you mean? Well, I don't know, but I think uh, you friendlies here lurking around. She might uh, She <laughs> might take that as an opportunity. All right, I'll go well, I don't to... I do know what, what you mean by that. I'll go to my instep, and uh, as the monarch, <laughs> I'll go find uh, out. draw... <laughs> And, and because of my archive, that makes me draw two. And pass to Tony. Uh, is Ryan playing artifact shenanigans? That's a question. Ryan, are you playing artifact shenanigans? It has about 22 artifacts, counting the commander. It has a lot of artifact synergy, but no, not really. Uh, friendly Steven's just dicking around if you get, catch my drift. All right, I'm going to shock myself by Watery Grave. <clears throat> I'm going to tap three. I'm going to play <laughs> Caliphate, Beloved of the Sea. Uh, her power is equal to her my devotion to blue. And okay, creatures nice. and enchantments I control have spells your opponents cast that target this permanent cost one more to cast. So she is currently a 3-3 three, three right now. Oh, my bad, guys. Uh, the draw's on the Monarch. Uh, Brandon, you lose two. Steven, you lose two. All right, bro. I'm about sick of you right now, Ron. I'm about sick of this. Do you hit him with a creature? As soon as I get one. <laughs> Brandon's got one. A, I, I have Brandon's looking a whole lot like the next king to me. <laughs> uh, dude, I am going to be a glorious king. Uh, with Monarch, do you just have to be attacked or dealt damage? Uh, you, you, attacked. You have to deal damage, right? I think damage. it has to be combat yeah. damage, right? Combat damage. So if you hit me for zero, it doesn't take it away. Yeah, it wouldn't, wouldn't do anything. Yeah. Bro, buff them uh, eggplants yeah. up, dog. Oh, my <laughs> God. Give them eggplants up, yeah. Put okay. some veins Here, on that thing. I can make the monarch token to be sure. Yeah, it's whenever he deals damage. Yeah, this thing's a blue chip. Yeah, I don't have one on me. <laughs> here, I'll, yeah, I'll leave that token up here for y'all. Get you one of them black egg plants, dog. <laughs> Good hand, Steven. If you catch my drill. <laughs> All right, Steven. Combo off the win. Leave me alone, right? I don't want to take my turn. I'm only doing it because, because not because you said so. <laughs> Oh, key trigger, sir. Um, I will put this insurrection into my graveyard because it seems really bad right now. <laughs> Why is it even in the deck? I don't understand what you're doing. Okay, here. that that transforms 
Yeah. And then it transforms. You're correct, Ryan. It's it's now identifying as an oh, as Cantor, <laughs> the sunken ruin. Which it is, show as hell is, Violet. If I'm reading correctly, it says that when you're in Grixis, you play this card because it ramps you. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's what that says. <laughs> yes. All right, and then I'm going to go draw. I'll draw Crack's Land. Okay. Ryan, click on my Cobra for Violet. Heck yeah, bro. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, he's having a little bit of a color identity. Crisis. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I know. What's wrong with the Cobra? Yeah. Well, there's he's, a lot of green he's, he's, on he's it. He's not feeling as green as normal. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of green on it. I got a green screen, so he's Stop looking a little it. Barack toned at the moment. <laughs> Dude, I know about that. I'll do this. I'm like going to actually pay three here and pay a blue. And I'm going to activate the Ascanta ability here. I'm going to tap it. Yep. And I'm going to leave it upright so I can read it. Uh, it says, Look at the top four cards in my library. May reveal a non creature, non land card from among them and put it in your hand. Watch me hit a creature. God, I hit a creature. Oh my God. <laughs> All right. So I can reveal a non creature, non land card and put it into my hands. All right, uh, do you guys? How do you guys feel about a wheel? I'm good with it. Uh, I would not like that. Uh, it wouldn't hurt me too bad. <clears throat> okay, well it's optional. We'll just say that. I could I could go with what's in my hand. Well, I'm gonna reveal wheel of misfortune, and then the rest of these cards go to the bottom. <clears throat> and so that's going in my hand, and I can cast it this turn. I do have the mana to cast it. Um, oh, that's a, oh, that's a card. Holy crap. Um, yeah, let's do that. Uh, I'm going to pay one, two, three, four, five, six mana, or six life, sorry. <laughs> Got confused there. And I'm going to cast the Consecrated Finksy Boy from the top of my library. I got a creature, boys! Bebop! Bebop is right. Bebop! Trying to decide if I'm on a wheel. You know what? I don't. I wouldn't mind it actually. Well, I can guarantee you, Ryan is probably not going to wheel. Uh, I'm going to cast Wheel of Misfortune with my remaining. Is it because I'm mono black? <laughs> no, because you've been drawing a bunch of cards with your mark, thing. You got plenty of cards in your head. How's right, this card work? You got to explain wheel? it again. <laughs> I, gotta I have no it. idea. <laughs> I gotta explain it every time, dude. Alright, so this wheel, it says... Each player... Sell me! <laughs> secretly chooses a number, <laughs> zero or greater. Then all players reveal those numbers simultaneously and determine the highest and lowest numbers revealed in this way. Wheel of Misfortune, not from League of Legends, deals damage equal to the Highest number to each player who chose that number. Each player who didn't choose the lowest number. I know it's getting confusing. Bear with me. We're almost there. <laughs> Discards their hand and wheels. So if you if you choose the lowest number, you don't wheel. Basically, and that goes for like so if like two guy if two people pick zero right then neither one of those players would wheel but they also wouldn't take damage. And let's say, like, Brandon picked one, I picked two. I would take two damage, and me and Brandon would wheel. You know what I'm saying? Yep. You feel me, dog? You catching what I'm putting down? I feel you, no. dog. I feel you. Tony doesn't. You get it, Tony? <laughs> it's a lot of shit. I feel like my, my brain just melted a little bit. So, trying to read the card. And so, the short and story it on it time. is you're going to pick a number. The lowest it's, number doesn't wheel. The yep. highest number takes damage. For that number, so if you pick a twenty and you're the highest number, you take twenty damage. You shouldn't pick twenty. <laughs> Everyone except for the lowest guy wheels. Wheels. So if you want a wheel, pick a number that's higher than zero, but you don't want to be the lowest number because you pick the lowest number, you don't wheel. The middle's where you want to be, unless yeah, you, you don't want to wheel. You want to be somewhere in the range of like you know forty All right. to fifty. All right. I'll play I'll just play it. <laughs> 
All right, everybody pick their number. How done? Hang on. Yeah. What's what's my lucky number today? I'm gonna look. Oh, I gotta look up my horoscope. Right. Second. Write it on something. I was gonna use a dice. Just like put a dice. Yeah, down. I got a dice. Y'all ready? Hold on. Let me read this card one more time. Make sure I'm done. I really don't. I violated the Texas speech broke. I'm sorry. I just finally want it read it again. Make it make sense. So there's a highest number and a lowest number, right? Everybody chooses, right? And then that card is going to deal damage equal to the highest number to each player who didn't choose that number. Who did choose the highest number? If you just. Pick Only the range. highest number takes damage. The lowest highest number doesn't wheel. Everyone else wheels. Yes. Freddy? Okay. okay. I'm ready to re reveal. <laughs> Hold on, Ryan's not ready. Oh, come on. Ryan. I'm, re I'm redoing it. All right, here we go. All right. I'm good. I'm All ready. Right. That makes All right. sense. All three. Here we go. One, two, three. Can you see two, it? Two, eight, it's a five. Four, five. <gasps> God dang it! <laughs> <laughs> so Tony doesn't wheel. Ryan takes eight, and then me and Brandon and Ryan wheel. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm pitching a return oh. of the wild speaker calling ritual, bloated contaminator, uh, a stinging study, Vraska's fall, corrupted conscience, and an island. Look what I'm ditching, dude. An Aether flux? wild. Whoa, yeah, dude! Where's Whatever. the top? Y'all want to know what's in mine? Nah, I don't care. <laughs> yeah, there's like a braids. <laughs> there's a braids in there somewhere. <laughs> All right, one, All right. two, three, four. Five. All right, actually, I like this hand better. Thank you. All right, so oh, we got some triggers on the stack. Steven oh, can draw oh. two cards for each one card, me and Brandon drew, so he can draw 28 more cards. True. <laughs> And then Ryan's about to ping the shit out of people. Yep. So. Oh my god, dude. Why do I keep helping Ryan win games? Do it! I'm so sick of this. Oh, my bad. Uh, I drew outside of... Hold on, hold on, hold on. I drew outside of my draw step, which means I draw two cards for every one card I would have drawn. So I draw 14. Uh, yeah, so you draw 14 <laughs> cards, and then 14 oh times. Oh my god. He's, he's doing 28 damage now. Hold on, hold on. Triggers, <laughs> yeah. triggers on the stack. Yes, it Well, I have to draw, draw cards for you to draw cards. <laughs> 14. I have to draw two cards 21. for every card that you eight. got. Bro. You can draw 28 cards, is that right? He can draw. <laughs> yes. I drew 14 alone. Right. So he draws 28 off me and he can draw. 28. Oh, yeah, 28 off you alone and then another seven. So another 14 on that. I'm just gonna draw until I feel like I'm content. Oh. <laughs> there's three. I'm just two. There's three. There's there's four. There's I mean, you can as long as you do it in five, pairs of two, I guess. There's. Six, I think it can draw. Sixty-three is what Violet's Sorry. coming up with. Violet's crunching the numbers. Well, you drew crunching seven numbers. and I drew fourteen, yeah, so that's twenty-one times two. Forty-two cards. <laughs> it's forty-two. He can draw up to forty-two cards. <laughs> It, I might as well keep drawing because I'm probably gonna die in a second. But anyways. but you, you got to draw even. You can't draw. Odd yeah, I know. I, I am. Yeah. I'm doing it. One, two, three. There's four, uh, five, and six. This and game got wild. Seven. Okay. Wait. I did. Use my hand. <laughs> that wasn't my strong suit. Me either, dude. That's why yeah. I just went with whatever you said. <laughs> okay. Hopefully, I survive, so I can actually play this game. Uh, all my triggers are going to target Steven. <laughs> Why? Because it's, it's funny. Because <laughs> it's lethal. <laughs> okay. All right. Jesus. I'm dead. You, you also have 40 cards in your hand. <laughs> oh, oh is, that, is that right? Yeah, okay. Mm. All right. Uh, let's see. I don't have any mana up, or I can be able to use that. Um, yeah, I don't have anything to do. I'm dead. Damn, right. Steven got a thick deck in his hand. Moans. <laughs> Steven died to a wheel. His yeah. own wheel. <laughs> died to his own wheel, dude. Don't worry, dude. I guarantee you next week when I play Magic with Ryan, <laughs> Ryan is going to want to call a suicide hotline for how difficult I'm going to make his life next week. 
I'll just play Gaddy yeah, or something. I'll play Cool and pay two. <laughs> and <laughs> I'll get a black mana from Lotus Cobra. Yes, Never sir. even got to do what my deck was supposed to do. And then I'll use the black mana from Lotus Cobra plus the black here. And I'll tap this. <laughs> and I'll cast out a Icarat. Uh, two on infect. When it enters the battlefield, uh -oh. each player gets a poison counter. Uh oh. Uh oh. That's so I got an infect. Tony got an infect. Yep, both of you fellas there got an infect. Tony's deck starting to look strong. <laughs> um, uh, click a uh, click the black bar at the top, and then oh, there's yep. one for infect on the miscellaneous for the commander damage. Yep. Nice dude, and then. I am going to. Damn, I wish I had one more mana. Uh, I couldn't tell if that was Oliver slamming stuff or if that was Steven. <laughs> <laughs> it could be either one. In my defense, all my stuff was on the board. Steven, Will didn't do it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you know what? Well, I don't care what's on your board because your birthday doesn't matter to me. Oh, you died to it. Well, no, no, because you had to do that. You chose that. You made that decision. And look, I I put an aether flux in the graveyard, dude. <laughs> I was trying to play nice, friendly Grixis magic. <laughs> play a soul ring. Okay. I wasn't even gonna combo out. That's how nice uh, I am. I'm gonna waste a man of whatever. I'm gonna pay one and a blue from the. Path and play Summer a throwing bird. card. I love this card. Yep. And then I'll go to combat and I will swing to it, Ryan. Hey, uh, somebody's a new monarch. I am the monarch. Uh, boom. Uh, when I uh, get take damage from a creature, uh, source screen flips back over. Uh, Grixis and, doesn't play nice. Exactly, and, Violet. And, and, and also, I, I ask myself the nice. same thing I, every time I see you in this chat. Why are you awake at four in the morning? <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, man. I don't know, but it keeps him up at night. <laughs> uh, I'll go to my end step and I draw a card, correct? Uh, yes, sir. You're the monarch. Nice, dude. Hell I'm yeah. Back yet again. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, so I will untap. I'm gonna put Sleepers that card back on week. top. Exactly. Um, upkeep. Really I got a roll for this man. Hey, Steven, if it makes you feel any better, you didn't get any poison I counters. That's damage. what my deck is, by the way. I go down to 27. I figured. Yeah. Um, and then I have no other upkeep triggers. Uh, I'm not the monarch anymore. I'll hide that for now. And you won't be the rest of this game, right? Uh, I can guarantee you will never be Monarch again. Okay. And you will be <laughs> Sure. And you have school at 9 a.m.? What the hell are you doing, <laughs> dude? Uh, Starscream is a creature on my turn. Uh, I don't have yep. to Kareem or anything. Uh, but, uh, like, whenever you hit him, he stops being a creature and becomes a vehicle on, like, your yep. turn. Yeah. Um, uh, and then I draw for my turn. Just one card. All right. But I do have a massive hand. So Zombie is a beast. I feel you there, dude. I'm going to play a snow-covered swamp. I'm going to tap this Lost Veil for three. And... I will float one of the black from that and use this one here for three mana. And I'll play an extra planar lens, exiling this swamp. Hmm. So all my swamps, the snow-covered ones specifically, uh, tap for two. Yep. Um, oh, look, another Ryan staple card. And he wants to get mad at me, dude, <laughs> for playing Steven staple cards. Are you serious? <laughs> well, it's just the fact that you said you, you made a point to say you built this deck different than you ever have. And then you pitched I, an Aether Flux and I played a bowl of Citadel. Realize the hypocrisy <laughs> is, in my is top, is top in the deck? It is. And you of know why? It is. <laughs> because it wins. <laughs> That's all right. Yeah, gonna, uh, Steven's going to be wait. so mad with this one, though. I'm going to play four mana. Full of tigers, and I'm going to play Aether Flux. <laughs> <laughs> 
Uh, wow, dude. And not only that, Ryan doesn't discard his Aether Flux. You see what he's doing, Tony? You should hit him. I, I, I did wheel. I drew this off the wheel, bro. Uh, I was trying to be nice. I discarded my Aether Flux. I could have played it. I could have won. I'm going to go ahead and go to combat. And uh, I'm going to swing this at Brandon. Uh, uh, he has flying and menace and haste. Yeah. Yeah. Don't mess with Texas. Boom. I, I become the monarch again. I know that's what y'all wanted to happen. Uh, hey. Yeah, dude. I couldn't wait for it to happen <laughs> again. Um, all right. Uh, I will tap this mana crypt for two. <laughs> I will use um, one of that to cast a <laughs> mana vault. <laughs> Which will gain me, well, um, let's see. One, two, three, three life. Back to 30. I don't and care how much damn life you got. I'll play a Jeweled Lotus, uh, which will put me to 34. I will tap that Mana Vault and my Swamp, leaving two black floating. I'll cast the One Ring. To give myself protection for the next turn. Um, I will go ahead and tap it to draw a card and add a counter to it. When I draw a card, I draw two cards. Tony has two eggs and a propaganda on the board, and you have about fifty thousand dollars worth of digital magic cards. How is this? How is this? Oh please. Oh please, you're right. It's seventy five thousand. How many of these? How many of these cards are in the deck that you were just playing? Uh, let's see. <laughs> Jewel Lotus, Aether Flux, Man of Vault, Man of Crypt. Oh, all the expensive ones. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Extra planner lens is expensive too. It's it's only like maybe thirty bucks now. That's, that's more money than I got. <laughs> all right. Uh, I played the one ring. I drew two cards. Brandon, uh, take lose four life. All right. Um. I have two black floating. I'll go ahead and use that on a jet medallion. Uh, black spells will cost one less. Um, uh, that gains me, what, five? The ring gained me five, and then that would gain me six to 45. I got... Oh, my bad. I, 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 back I, back I, back I don't understand. <laughs> I don't know either, Violet. All that's just ramp. <laughs> All that's just ramp. And then an enhancer. All right, so I did have to tap this. I was counting my lands as three there for a second, but it's only two, so I had to tap that to do everything I've done so far. I only have two mana left. Ramp! Ramp! I know, dude. I don't know how he survived with all this ramp. Uh, I'll go ahead and... Ring is nutty, I know. I'll go ahead and go to end step. Uh, also, I'm the Monarch, in case anyone forgot... Uh, that makes me draw two cards, but then I have to discard down. I'll go ahead and discard the Soul Ring and a Swamp and a Swamp and a Swamp. One more Swamp just in case. <laughs> and we'll pass turn. That's a lot of Swamps. Yeah, I'll clean my board state up a little bit. All right, last turn right here, everyone. Also, you can't interact with Ryan at all because he plays fair magic. <laughs> I'm gonna exile this one. Showing off, yeah, I know, dude. The worst part's the hypocrisy, right? <laughs> uh, we'll tap out and play the eldest reborn. Make you sacrifice, sacrifice my creature. creature. Not like this. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, it's so this it's around the ring, actually. Nice, yeah. dude. Hell yeah. Yes. Uh, I'll sack my Icarats. <clears throat> Good ass play.
No point in attacking Ryan. I mean, Brandon, we got to band together to try and take him out. I agree with you. Does oh. Anthony have propaganda? Yes, he does. I agree yeah, with I'll you. Just, I'll just read more. Sorry, I didn't click on mm -hmm. anything on my turn. I always forget to do that. Don't worry. We know what your staples do. Uh, Eldest <laughs> Reborn. I actually, I love that Eldest Reborn card. It it was so good for so long, and then finally some cards got better than it. <laughs> I played on Arena a lot. Yeah. yeah, Nick used to play that card like every time you sit down and play Magic with him. Mm. Uh, yeah. Uh, they like the effect because they made that new shield be very, very similar. <laughs> Uh, nice. Okay, so we are going to play this Ink Moth Nexus. And I will get a blue mana. Dang, I missed some triggers, but I'll, I'll let it go. <laughs> did, they, did they take that uh, Ink Moth Nexus image directly from the Shadowlands in Baldur's Gate 3? Uh, I, I believe so. they did, yeah. yeah it looks like. Soul Ring for two. Uh, three, four. Dude, if Brandon plays a Skittles. Nah, I will play my own one ring. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> That's fair. <laughs> Y'all gross, man. That's fair, I guess. Oh, boy. And how can there be two one rings on the battlefield at the same time? Someone explain this to me. Uh, I messed up pretty bad on my turn. How so? Uh, I gain, I'm supposed to gain double the life from Aether Flux. Hey, bro. Oh, oh no. We ain't taking a misplay counter on that. Sorry. Uh, you can pay attention to your board state whenever you kill me, but okay. That, that's fine. Uh, I also forgot to do the damage from drawing off the mark at the end, but that's fine. Too. I ain't worried about it. Four life. What's for life between friends? Right. Uh, I'm going to use the blue mana that I made. And also, I'll tap this breeding pool for a Icker Claw Mirror. 1-1 uh, one, one Infect. Whenever it becomes blocked, it gets plus 2, plus 2 until end of turn. Uh... Yeah, I'm just going to end my turn there. Pretty sure Ryan has at least one card in his hand, right? I have seven cards in hand. Oh, yeah. He no longer got, has protection like I have. <laughs> that is true. Um, Yeah, I will. Okay, well, let me rephrase. Tony's dead. <laughs> oh, <fuck. laughs> I will untap. I got some upkeep stuff going on. Uh, so I'll put the card back on top. Uh, upkeep. I have to take one from Mana Vault, and then I have to flip for Mana Crypt uh, to Heads. I don't take damage. Let's see what else I got. Upkeep, 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 upkeep. Uh, I got the Burden Counter from the One Ring, so I'll lose one life from that. Yep. Quick, now's your chance. Hit him while he's low. Uh, <laughs> I'm not the Monarch. Or did you not hit me, Brandon? Uh, I did not hit you, no. You let me stay Monarch. I couldn't hit you. You had protection. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, all right. Sometimes I forget whenever uh, I put a card I, on two I draw a card. I put holes in mine. <laughs> uh, I'm always wearing one. I will play a land. <laughs> Just in case. You never know. I'm going to tap this for three and then this for two for f five mana, but I only need four. I guess I'll just leave that on tap and tap it. So you pull holes in yours? I'm How's going. Going, I'm going to cast it. Not well. <laughs> I'm going to cast Exquisite Blood. Mm. Oh shit! I'm glad I got protection. Okay, all right. Just someone call Mr. Cool. <laughs> tell him to watch this episode. <laughs> nope. Uh, okay, and then I'm going to uh, pay four as well and, and cast Gray Merchant of Asphodel. So you guys lose life equal to my devotion to black, which is actually only three, uh, and, I, and, I, and I gained the total amount. Which would be 12. Yeah, because it's doubled. Yeah. 
Uh, so that goes to, I was at 43, so 40, 55. Uh, but whenever you, you lose life, I'll also gain that much life. So I'll gain 12 more. To 67, right? Uh, and then I will pay 50 with my Aether Flux and shoot Tony for 50. You got it. Damn, it. dude. Ryan's a loser. Wow, dude. He had two eggs on the board. Too much for you to handle. You want me to shoot them first? <laughs> shoot each egg individually. And then gain the life back. Yeah. I like that idea. So Tony lost 27 life down to zero, so I gained 27 back immediately. They got it. I doubled. One ring. Doubled, so I gained 54 back immediately. Back to 70 something. In the 70s range. Well, it just doubled, right? <laughs> yeah, it was 27. I was at 27. I shot him, and he was at 27. But I gained it back double. So, 50. Yeah. So what you're 50, saying is I, just, I just chose the wrong deck. <laughs> 81. <laughs> yeah, yeah bro, there's always next week. Well, Steven was, did make me draw 14 cards and deck, kill himself. Kill himself. <laughs> <laughs> I yeah. was too, Tony. <clears throat> Ryan okay, decided he was bitches. playing CEDH tonight. <laughs> no kidding. You, when you sit down trying to play some casual commander and then something like this happens. So, the, like, so yeah, y'all want me to play the Bola Citadel or... <laughs> Wow, dude. I mean, I put mine in the graveyard, but, you know, or, I'm just a nice guy, so. Or do you want me to play my commander and then Necrologia for, like, 40? <laughs> I will I'll pass I will pass I'll turn to Brandon. Uh, at your end step, I'm going to tap my one ring. All right. We're bringing the heat next week. <laughs> All right, bro. Card. I'll bring a pre-con so y'all can beat up on me. You can play a pre-con <laughs> elf deck or something. Draw I'm gonna laugh when y'all lose to the freak on update. <laughs> we'll see about that, dude. <laughs> I I I did forewarn these guys. I said if my deck goes off, it's real nasty. Uh huh. Well, Brandon, let's tap see my what... one ring and draw two cards. Is this your turn now? Yep. How much infect does Ryan have? He only has one. Uh, I just Please shoot him with. Nine. I just shoot him with Aether Flux whenever I want. I mean, I was thinking you could maybe get your Infect guy in there somehow. It does, like he said, it doesn't matter. He just he either has frozen grip or he loses. <laughs> yeah, he Aether Flux when I move to combat stuff, I die. Yeah, there's nothing I can do. I lose. Wait, you don't have protection anymore. No, no, it goes away at the beginning of turn. My, on my step, yeah. Oh. Yeah, no, I lose. Wow, what a fun game of magic. Uh, congratulations. <laughs> hey, Starscream got there, boys. I <laughs> say GG, <laughs> but I didn't get to play. So. <laughs> Our, uh, to quote the, the video I watched earlier, are you blind or stupid? Starscream goes, stupid, stupid. <laughs> Is that actual dialogue yes. or a bridge? No, it was actual dialogue from the old Generation 1 Transformer show. <laughs> wow, dude. Back in the day, you could yeah. say anything, huh? Yeah. That is true. You say Jeez. stupid nowadays, dude, and you get like... This is a combo I never suspected to see. Exactly, Violet. <laughs> exactly. What combo? <laughs> uh, Me and Aether Steven Flux. Yelling. Killing they, somebody, they I blood? assume. It happens every week on this show. <laughs> it happens like three <laughs> episodes a month, dude. <laughs> yeah. in, my, in my defense, my version's slightly different. <laughs> Don't defend yourself, dude. I put my Aether Flux in the graveyard because I was showing a sign of respect, all right? I mean, I could have not played that and played my commander and killed him that way. <laughs> they were still dead this turn regardless. <laughs> You also didn't have to target me with 28 damage. You made, yeah, it, hashtag, you, or, you made it too easy. That's Steve. what we need to do. Lotto, you got a good idea. That's what we need. I get the misplay counter going up, but we'll have the laser beam death counter as well. <laughs> or the times. lame wind counter. I'm going to rename it the, the lame wind counter. Laser beam of death 69. Is... We get all this just because I played Aether Flux in a deck one time? <laughs> uh, no, 
I give Steven shit too every time he does it. This is why I discarded it, dude. It's he can't interact with. There's like fucking two cards in Magic history that can interact with the motherfucker. It didn't didn't deflecting SWAT is one of them. <laughs> yeah, deflecting SWAT, frozen grip, and the green besedju that I had already played as a land because I didn't draw a forest. All right, do y'all play? Y'all want to play again, or are we just call it? Yeah. I'm down to play another one. I will. Yeah, I, I will one. purposely keep a really I'm slow hand. Up, I'm like, <laughs> I might change up my deck. <laughs> I might play a different deck. Right. I don't know if I'm going to play for something that's slow. For All right. This, Somebody's this. like, I'm bringing more than just two eggplants to the table next time. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> if you know what I'm saying, bro. You know what I mean, dude. Yeah. All right. Unfortunately, I got to go, but I'll be watching y'all. I'll be praying for you, Tony. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm supposed to win when Steven doesn't whirl me into 14 cards. I know, dude. Oh, man, I know now who are you going to shoot with your Aetherflux to hold all your damage? <laughs> <laughs> all right, GG's, yo. All right, GG. yeah. <laughs> hey, I ain't worn in a while. I had to do something about it, okay? <laughs> uh. <laughs> uh, you just want to throw champ down there and do yeah, three. We'll, what do we'll, you want to do? Uh, we'll throw champ down if nobody in chat's available. Let me uh, get the uh, stream labs and stuff up here. Let's see what champ's up to. We ain't seen him in a while. Oh, 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 not, oh, 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 oh. Is he there? Is he still in there? No, it was the Steven streaming at the screen. Oh. <laughs> There Can never get this thing in here right. Perfect. At least that when I played Aetherflux and won, it was like my last turn. I was I was either <laughs> dead or I had to do something. Right. Nothing you could do. I think I have like the Aetherflux combo in one deck. I don't yeah, I, I think that's my only one. Boom. This one has Sanguine Blood, Exquisite Blood, or Sanguine Blonde, Exquisite Blood, and then Aetherflux. Combo. I had that in my order. Brandon, uh, do you know the one I'm talking about? San Enchantment. Sanguine Blood, Exquisite Blood. Yeah. Yeah. You do <clears throat> gain like one beat of life, one life, and it kills everybody. Yeah, it kills everybody. Yeah, yeah you, you got to it before I could. I would like to, you know, give Steven the, uh, I don't know, what, like, what's the most valuable sister medal? <laughs> you uh, say did that game to me with that wheel. Yeah, yeah. I don't know why you did that, Steven. Uh, you guys need to reset your life totals or whatever. Yeah. Oh yeah. Over here. There it is. Oop! There it is. Uh, I'm ready to go whenever I like my hand. Uh, I kept a purposely really slow hand so y'all don't have to freak out. Yeah, you'll have to give you the the real cards over here so I can actually <laughs> shuffle them. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. No. there you go. Uh, I was gonna build this one in real cards because uh, I I got the star screen man. I just uh, it was much more simple to not have to put sleeve a hundred cards. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I did put like revases <clears throat> back together and updated with a couple of new things. Because uh, I was going to get Joanna to stream, but then she had some shit that she had to do. Now, Brandon, now you see why I said that if Joanna was playing this week, <laughs> I, this feels yeah. like a Joanna dick. <laughs> Probably, yeah. I mean, I see what you mean. And I think you could tone this deck down a lot, but like once I started building it, everything just fell into place. Well, it's just the mana ramp. Like, anytime you ramp up that quickly, there's only so much you could do. And again, when Steven wheels you. Well, yeah, when I have the best enhancer in my deck on the board and, and I'm already set up, <laughs> and you just wheel right into it. Yeah. Yeah, that'll do it. I had to reread re -read the wheel like four times because, like, is this just win me the game on the spot? I was like, <laughs> if I say 30, 
does everyone take 30 damage and they all die? Yeah, like, okay. <laughs> like, like, I'm so confused. No, that wouldn't work because then <laughs> yeah. anyone could just be like, a billion! And yep. then everyone, the card just ends every game immediately. <laughs> yes, perfect. <laughs> <laughs> it's the best card. Well, no, it wouldn't do that. It would be, because you take the damage too. So if you want to win, you just have to be, be at the high, you have to be at the highest life. And you do like one point. <laughs> like, Below that? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's like earthquaking when you're winning. Just earthquake. <laughs> Whatever anyone else has. True. Hey, whatever works. All right, guys. My hand has four swamps and no ramp. Well, I guess we'll <laughs> so, re roll, huh? <laughs> Boom. I rolled yeah, a 16. Yeah, well, uh, let me get rid of my monarch. Do, 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 do. I rolled a 16. Ooh. I'll roll a Ryan, 12. roll a 16. I'll roll a 12 sided. That way, make sure you. I rolled a 12. Ah. Ah. Uh, <laughs> all right. Re roll. I rolled a 19. 17. Hey, I go first. I'm, I uh, go first. I'm taking a mulligan. All right. I'm ready whenever. I think my, my beginning hand. It's not great. Who, who's first? Tony? It ain't bad. No, I'm uh, first. Brandon. Tony. Okay. I almost had it right. You're buying the card a little bit, Brandon. Is that better? Actually, I'll move myself so I'm sitting on top of the card. I like that. Be better. Oh, no. Man, Tack Ogre should have been like, if everyone cared. <laughs> Nobody cried. <laughs> he like wheels <laughs> and puts like 40 stacks on the chip. <laughs> How the hell we wind up like this? <laughs> <laughs> what, do you, what am I supposed to do? He's, he can play the top card of his deck at any time. He's got 40 cards in his hand. Yeah. How do you not turn him with the triggers? <laughs> I mean, I agree with you. Especially when it was perfect lethal, because he was at 27. <laughs> yeah, you did what, 28? 28, what yeah. 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 Like, All honestly, right. I had to get myself in the mind frame playing this deck, because I was playtesting it a little bit ahead of time, that, like, I could possibly infect Hatred somebody turn three. Yeah. And so I was kind of having to get ready. Like, if I could, if I could pull it off, I'm going to infect kill somebody. Absolutely. Immediately. All right, I'm ready. Let's get it going, boys. Nice, dude. All right. Uh, I, dude, I've been playing first for so long. I draw, right? Still? Yeah, you still draw. Okay, nice. You'll never believe what I just drew. Sorry. Yeah. So I switched decks, my deck to elves. Ooh. I think, you know, so <laughs> before I get started, I said on stream the other day, uh, when we were playing with Tony, I said I was talking about when I first started playing Magic and I needed to get back to my roots of what Tony <laughs> taught me, and that was play more Wolves, more Gruel, and more Elves. <laughs> and I'll be damned if they didn't put out a Naya Commander that's Wolves and Elves. <laughs> I think I'm going to build it. I think I'm going to build it. Man. Never played Elves before, but I think I'm going to build that one. Elves is such uh, a fun <laughs> archetype, to me, at least. Some people find it's it kind of boring. Uh, just a fun archetype of deck. I've never played it. I've played goblins. I've played dragons, sea creatures. Elves is my favorite. Hwaf nexuses. I'll pass turn. Elves is like go wide, fast, like faster than goblins. <laughs> That's pretty fast. Because you're making a bunch of mana with like every elf. Right. Also, this is like one of my favorite magic cards of all time. This was the first ever like expensive magic card that I pulled out of a a pack that I bought. Uh, that's that card's in my deck too. It was like twenty dollars at the time. I don't know what it's what it costs now, but in like two thousand eleven or ten or whatever it was. All right, I'm playing Moss Warp Bridge as Hideaway. Hideaway. I love that card. Comes in. Look at the top four cards in my library. Ryan made fun yeah. of me for playing that card. I, I like one that face card. down. Yeah, that's Though I do think it's, that's it's the right. only hideaway card that I do like. I don't like any of the other ones. I, I feel like a lot of cards have certain decks they can go in like that. Could 
perfectly fine in a Galta deck. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, like that card's great in a Galta deck. You immediately get it going. You're Mine not... was an Omnath. Yeah. And sea creatures. Yeah. And pass. All right. Uh, draw for turn here. I'll play a swamp, and I've got nothing to play. Oh, this pass. is that like this is the elf that everyone likes, huh? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Last real. player create that many. Then tap ten LC control. Each opponent lose ten life. You gain ten life. Golly. All right. Uh, my turn. Huh? Uh, we cool. gotta keep up with uh, Ryan over here. I'm going slow this time. Y'all, y'all got time. <laughs> uh, we're going to go... Uh, I did my thing. With... It happened the first game. <laughs> Starstream became king of the world. <sighs> yeah, but my coast, and I'll pay... One life. One life to go a green. And Lotus Cobra. Cobra's back. Yeah, the Cobra back. All right, I'm done playing cards from last game now. I'll pass <laughs> I don't believe you. Shuffle like Steven. No, that really was the last one. Yeah. All right. I'm going to play a Swamp, play Talisman of Resilience, and right. then I'm going to lose a life, tap for green, and play Elvish Mystic. Right on time. I'm just kidding. Here we go. <laughs> he played a tap in turn one. All right. Uh, draw for turn. I will play a Swamp. And I'll just pay two and play a cranial plating. Nice. Are you playing snow covered Custer. swamps only because of extra planar lens that it's less likely other people have snow covered swamps? Yeah. I'll try hard at this one Fair a enough. little bit. Fair enough. Draw. Uh we will. I was very concerned that Starscream didn't actually do anything. So I probably overcompensated in the deck a little bit. <laughs> It seems fun. Like I, I love the idea of like just draw to do damage. Yeah, it's got shield. I like the uh, the Esper yeah. guy, Qu- Quaza, Quaza. You know what I'm talking about. Yeah. Uh, we'll play a watery grave. Pay two for it, uh, and I will. Uh. I'll make a black mana with Lotus Cobra. Oh. I wish there, is there no way of doing that on spell table of like showing? Uh, I think it's letter M. M. You see it on the screen? Oh, down here. Okay, I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Uh, so I got a black mana. There we go. Let's move this stuff up. Um, and then I will. Tap there, and I will tap here, and I'll pay another life for green, and I'll cast a tree visits. Tree. Tree visits. And I'll go get a forest card. I just want that one. Uh, I'll get, oop, where to go? Overgrown Tomb. Uh, I'll let that one come in tapped. And when it does, I'll get, uh, another black mana from Lotus Cobra. And then I'll use my two black mana from Lotus Cobra, and I'll tap the Watery Grave. I lied. I'll play Nicorats. Um, will you just get a poison? Uh, you each get a poison counter. All right. Uh, and then I will go to combat, and I'll swing to it, Ryan, with a Lotus Cobra. And pass my turn. You just want two at me? Yeah. All right. Two from the Cobra, dude. I... It's a damn shame the Cobra doesn't have a uh, toxic or something, you know. <laughs> sure. I'm gonna Death cultivate. Cultivate. Ooh, damn, dude. Nice. nice. I wish I had a cultivate right now. 
Let me get me two forests. And then... I'm getting heavily out ramped here. My hand was bad or something. Uh oh. <laughs> Heritage Druid. There's more oh. ramp, dude. Dude, Heritage Druid is so good. Elf, control. Add three green mana. Turns everybody into a Lana Werewolf. Um. Pass. The art on elf cool. Uh, the, the, the art on elf cards are pretty cool, too. <laughs> yeah, dog. Did you ever see my modern elf deck when I had it built? I don't remember. It's your turn, Ryan. Nope. Oh, yep, my bad. Uh, untap draw. Let's see. Uh, 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 my bad. I did my life total on the wrong thing. I did it on Moxfield, not on here. Spell table. <laughs> Uh, Y'all remember who sent them, you know? I, you know, I gave Tony some eggplants last time. I'll give Brandon the eggplants this time. Woo! Couple eggplants, huh? <laughs> Couple eggplants uh, for me. Yeah. This is turn four, right? I can play a land. Yeah. Yeah, dude. Right? Uh, uh, this is turn... We, we, we both ramped. I know that. Uh, yeah, so... I think this is turn three. Turn three, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah all right. Yep. Uh, pass turn. Oh, one plants or one one plants? What are they? They're O2 plant. O2 plants? Yeah. Okay. Boom. Nice, dude. I'm going to give these things toxic. <laughs> My turn, untap, upkeep, draw. All right. All right. Oh, I got to get these things over here where you guys can see them. Hey, even your tokens ain't the right color. No, it's fine. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> uh, We'll play this island, and we'll make a black mana. And then we will go ahead, I believe. We'll use the black mana. One, two, three, four, five. Is it five or six? Five. All right, nice, dude. We'll use five mana there, and we are going to mutate uh, Godzilla on top of my Icarats. Mm hmm So he is a 6-6 six, six trample infect. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, and then we'll go to combat and we will swing six of Ryan. <laughs> yeah, that is what we're going to do. Okay. I go to seven infect. It does no actual damage to you. Yep. 
Nice. Mm. Uh, <clears throat> actually, uh, before damage, I swing the six at Ryan. You have no blockers, correct? No. No response to the attack? No. Uh, I'll invigorate it as well. All right, well, I'll die. <laughs> Boom. Uh, yeah. You gain f three life, though. Neat. I'll pass turn over to Tony. Well, shit. <laughs> Oh, uh, the glad, trigger. Uh, you better be uh, glad you decided to do that because I had damnation in my hand. <laughs> did you really? Ah, I knew it was a good idea. Uh, Tony, get one more poison counter. Lotto says the Icarat's ability triggers again when I mutate. Okay. I always have a little time to generate a new TMC meme and post it in Discord. Ooh, what's the new TMC meme in Discord? <laughs> it's great. Right, you gotta go look at it. What, in Discord? Yeah. We're <laughs> <clears throat> <clears throat> gonna hmm. tag him in it. You have any removal there, pal? Nah. Oh, that ain't good. I think you're right, Lotto. I've I've played it a little bit on. Um... I don't I don't think it because it's already it's already on the field, so you're just mutating onto it. Yeah, I don't think it triggers yeah. again. At least, so. at least, at least on arena, it only triggers if uh, Icarats had the mutate ability, and its mutate was if it mutated, Ooh. then it dealt poison. Yeah, I think you're right. You're right. Yeah, and Lotto says he he's wrong. Okay, yep, good catch. <laughs> uh, well. Yeah, mutate's weird, Lotto. Like when I was building this deck, I kept putting mutate creatures in, and then like taking them out. And then putting them back in. Like, I don't know how this works. I think, like, Jim Razor, the one that ramps, is good. Jim Razor, uh, yeah, the Migratory yeah. Great Horn. Dreamtail Heron is good. It draws yeah. cards and gives flying. The Octopus one? Uh, yeah, that one's okay. That's like probably the most played one. Mm -hmm. I actually don't play any of those. I actually, the only mutate I think I left in here is, of course, the commander and the one that um, Nick played one time, the whatever, the playful thing. I don't remember. Oh, Tamari <laughs> or something? The playful one? I played Elvish Champion. Other Elvish you control get plus one, plus one, and have Forest Walk. <clears throat> um, maybe if I can live one more time. I don't know. It depends on how much poison you're going to do. One of the creature mutates you may cast target non creature card and then do three less from your creeper without paying its mana cost. <clears throat> that is good. What is that? That's white, blue, and double red. Oh, Vadrock. Yeah, Vadrock. That sounds fun. Uh, oh, yeah, you my, passed? My turn? Yeah, I passed. Yeah, exactly. my friend my friend Andy has a uh, mutate deck. Five color with the uh, Gigantha as the commander. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'll play a forest. I'll get a black mana from Cobra. Uh, I'll use the black mana from Cobra, and I'll tap the island, I guess, there. And uh, my rat's back over there. 
we'll play an arcane signet. Oh, mistakes were made. Mistakes were made, dude. Uh, I'll go to combat and swing. 6-6 six, six, infect Godzilla. Uh, I will block it with everything. I thought you would. Uh, one. Oh, uh, I got three. a 3-3, three, three, a 2-2, two, two, and another 2-2. Two, two. I'll hatred for 30 life. <laughs> what the fuck is that? Uh, it. Pay X life, target creature gets oh, plus X for the whole. turn, so I'm giving him plus 30. So he's a 36 6 trample infect. I hate infect. I hate it. I know, everyone does. That's why, like, when infect came out, I, I stopped playing for, for a year. That's when I stopped playing for a while. Infect was actually the first deck that I ever built. They had a, they had a pre-con. Was, I don't know what, like, format it was. But it was Golgari, and it had Putrefax in there. I think it was standard and then I found, at the time. Was it standard? Oh, yeah. and the ne- bro, not even gonna fucking lie to you. I clicked my deck to draw. There's Skithrix. <laughs> uh, then I found Skithrix, the Blight Dragon, and fell in love. This is my all-time favorite card in Magic history. Yeah. Skithrix is so fucking cool. My hideaway card was uh, nothing good. <laughs> oh, shit. Jahira, dude. Hell yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, this is why I built Brockos Infect before and played like two games and took it apart. <laughs> because you either get stomped into the fucking ground immediately, or you have to like you can't kill somebody with Infect and then like hope to give, get a chance to kill somebody else with Infect most of the time. Because you kill somebody with Infect and then the rest of the board goes. Oh, okay, well, fuck this guy. <laughs> and then you die. Works better in a three-player game, huh? It does work better <laughs> in a three-player game. Uh, I did get super lucky, dude. I drew hate- I drew Invigorate and then drew Hatred. So Yeah, I don't know what it, what the game would look like uh, if you didn't Invigorate me there, but I was going to Damnation on my turn. <laughs> uh, it would have been too bad because I was drawing Skithrix in, like, two turns. So... And I would have still had the hatred in hand. So that would have... But that's a lot more mana. But yeah. I had uh, the follow-up to Damnation. I had uh, Siphon Mind and just getting my commander out and getting that going. Back on the shelf it goes. I had Crater Hoof and Elven Chorus in my hand. Elven Chorus is fun. I like that. Yeah, I want to build that... What is that card called? Uh... Badrock? Uh, no, no, no. The elf. Uh, I saw it earlier in here. All right, oh, guys. The one that makes the wolf. Oh, if y'all yeah. want to check out our deck list, they're on Moxfield. You can always uh, find our deck list there, except for Tony. Is this is this set out? What that? What is that? It, it comes out. It comes out next uh, week. It's next the week. Uh, Murders of Karlov. Oh hell yeah, dude. I've been uh, I've been drafting quite a bit lately on arena because like there's nothing around me in Mississippi, uh, but I've uh, I've been getting back into draft quite a bit. It's a lot of fun. I'm enjoying yeah, it. I like I like draft. It's not as fun on arena. I like like bullshitting and passing the cards around and getting to look at them, but mm-hmm. it's better than not drafting, I guess. <laughs> And like if you're decent at it on arena, you can like keep it going pretty good. I mean, I didn't even get my good cards like Orcish Bowmaster or like Villas. Dude, I <laughs> also have Oak. So my dream for this deck is to Orcish Bowmaster and like somehow either with uh Phyresis or Corrupted Conscience or Tainted Strike, somehow give Orcish Bowmaster uh infect. And then have Steven wheel me. That's the dream. <laughs> yeah, this is... Uh, what's the deck? The Cabal Coffers Modern deck? Uh, this is kind of similar. It just It's a draw engine with big mana. You just play way more stuff than everyone else. And that stuff grindily kills people down. Fair enough. You'll draw more cards... You, Get more mana. That's really all the deck cares about. 
sometimes like that second game, if you go against a deck that's a lot of pressure real fast, you'll just die. You're not earning very much way to protect yourself. I don't think there was anything else. But shout out to Steven for handing me that first game. <laughs> first time. Classic hatred reaction. <laughs> exactly, too. I knew, I'm so glad Lotto was in the chat because I knew Lotto was going to love the hatred. Yeah, I hate that card. <laughs> I like found that card like a few years back and I was like, oh, I want to use this in like a deck. And I've never pulled it off, but Brandon like pulls it off every time he puts it in the deck. <laughs> yeah, dude, like I've won like multiple games with hatred. It's, uh, I like that one. I forget what other game did I win it with. You one shot me with it in a game. You've one shot Nick with it in a game. I couldn't um, remember what the other deck was that I had it in though. And you probably one shot Steven at some point. Maybe so. I don't remember. It's great what deck killing it was. people players with other people's commanders. That's a good idea, Lotto. Maybe that's what I'll build next. Maybe I'll build a theft de uh, deck next and try to kill everyone on the board with their own commanders. To be honest, this deck could play Hatred. <laughs> uh, I mean, any deck can play Hatred. It's a great card. Well, I mean, like, I have so many ways to gain that life back. I have, I'm running, like, uh, the Whip to give uh, lifelink. Uh, oh, it's my Blood Magic deck. Uh, Lycia. That's yeah, what I got yeah. it in. Like, I've got Basco's Collar, I've got the Whip of Erebos for lifelink. So I can just have lifelink and then hatred, or I can just have uh, Exquisite Blood. So whenever I hit him, I just gain all the life back. Yeah, dude, I think I'm going to build this Wolf and Elves deck for next week. All right, speaking of that, I'm going to add hatred right now. <laughs> you should, dude. Uh, I, don't, I don't really like these court cards, even though they're monarchy. I don't like them. They're too slow. Yeah, I don't like the court cards either. I tried to play those back in the day, and uh, yeah, you're right. They just You play them, and then you die before they become useful. Or you just never get monarch again. <laughs> I'm trying to think. What other good mono black The green cards? one's good. Which one? The green, the green uh, court. What's the green court do? Is that that's the one one I, yeah, that's the one I played uh, last week. Or a week before last, whichever. I think the only chord I've tried playing is the white one in my token stack, and it was too slow. So should I take the casual tag off this one? <laughs> yeah, I probably would. I probably would. Yeah, it's kind of nasty. But all right, guys, we're going to wrap this up. Thanks for hanging out. We will catch y'all next week. I'll fulfill the uh, prediction for you guys real quick. Those of y'all who voted for me, you know, you're welcome. What can I say <laughs> besides you're welcome? You're welcome, yeah. There you go. <laughs> no one voted for me. Okay. Dude, That's I just I realized my Yodora deck has 146 views on uh, Moxfield. You should check out Austin's uh, Brewmaz deck. <laughs> oh, is it, is it got like ridiculous views? I wonder if I can just find it. Uh, I don't know how to spell Brumaz, actually. It Blight, right? That's the one. This, or do you not follow Austin? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how to do that. Right, What's his uh, name I'll, on here? I'll do it. I'll just, I'll just bring it up. It's Tachyon, just like this card. Right. Oh, there it is. Yeah, I found him. <laughs> it has... 663 views. <laughs> yeah, he's almost there. Wow. Dude, every time he plays Brimaz, the YouTube video goes wild. <laughs> YouTube loves Vermont. He told, he told me that like uh, people would like comment on this deck list, and he's like, I oh, I don't care. Just leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> Use it. I don't care. <laughs> That's awesome. It's pretty funny. All right, guys. Like I was saying, we'll catch y'all next week. No, Thanks for hanging out. We'll do it again. Play more magic with less infect. 
we'll less, do something different. Less Monarch. Monarch OP. <laughs> we'll do something with the Monarch, maybe. I don't know what we're going to do. We'll figure it out. Just, uh, tune in next week. See what we do. Join the Discord. Tell us what to do. Heck yeah. Follow us on Twitter and Bo- watch what we do. Boss us around. Anyway, thanks for watching. <laughs>